Uh, it's almost midday, it's not good morning. I normally say good morning. And uh, I'm on the Wigston AC um, water canal. Um, this uh, canal I've not fished for many a year, probably took it 30 years. And that's back over this lock to the right, about 100 yards. Remember having some nice rud in the winter under some ice. Um, but uh, I, I heard about this new estate that's cropped up and does look beautiful. Looks a lovely place to, to stay, uh, to live, sorry. So I, uh, I decided to uh, buy the Wixton book, as you can see. And um, I've met uh, one of the Wixton committee men uh, on there. Um, Mr. S. Pratt. Um, so, um, he informed me that he, he knows George. I, I didn't actually ask the question whether or not um, it was uh, related. But um, anyway, um, as you can see, people walking over the bridge here. And uh, yeah, I've been told where the water's coming out, which is the like a bit of an overflow from the lock that um, it's good for chub. So, whoa. We might get into some of those, but my, my standard line of attack today is going to be a, uh, a CXX2 4B14 um, on a 16 up direct 014 line for getting some stripers out. Here I've got a, an Exner prototype float, which is a far shelf float that we're developing, and here I've got a, a Census uh, Jeff 0.3. Uh, nice yellow tip with a with a green tinge on it, so it's a lovely background colour. So yeah, um, I'm fishing about I'd say about four four and a half foot deep. Um, this canal was dredged a little while ago, a couple of years ago. So my uh, Wixton friend told me, and um, yeah, it's it's a great far shelf. Um, I've already plumbed it. It's looking superb. So anyway, let's get on with a bit of fishing and see what I can catch.